Welcome to today's lesson. In today's lesson, we are learning how to read, write, and count numbers using the best practices and the right tools. Elementary should learn to read, write, and count numbers as they learn the place value of the numbers. I recommend learning to count up to 10 using a 10 frame. Elementary learners should be counting to 10 using a 10 frame and using counters by placing counters on this 10 frame so that they, as they learn their numbers, they see these numbers in relation to 10. And a, using a counter on a 10 frame enables a, an emergent learner C1 in relation to 10. As they learn to identify the number one, they are learning that one is nine away from 10 and that one counts up to 10. They should learn that ones lead up to a 10, 10, tens, lead up to 100, 10 hundreds leads up to a thousand. Elementary learners should learn that once, counting once, counting single numbers or counting ones leads up to a 10. They should also learn that counting tens leads up to a hundred, counting a hundred leads up to a thousand and the numbers just follow a continuum. Elementary learners benefit from both the visual aid and the, and the use of manipulatives to learn how to read, write, and count numbers. I have written the number 23 on this board. An elementary learner should learn that 23 does not exist in isolation. An elementary learner needs to learn that the two digits in the number 23 each have a place. Two belongs in the tenths place and the ones belongs in the ones place. And what tools are necessary for an elementary learner as they learn to read, write, and count numbers? A 10 frame, a place value mat, counters, hundreds, tens, and ones cubes. All of these tools are available on my website. Please follow the instructions below to download these tools, these math tools for your elementary learner. To help our elementary learners learn to read, write, and count numbers, I have created a video right next to this video a math video titled learn to read write and count numbers in this video i show that we learn to count using tens ones tally marks and also a simple math equation that puts these numbers that helps to show the place of these numbers thank you see you in the next lesson